Hi everyone, my name is Rushab and today we are going to learn an excellent feature in Excel called Goal Seek. It comes under the what if analysis. Let's take a scenario where you are a dealer of a particular product and every month you have certain costs to bear. So your fixed costs every month are $10,000 owing to office rent, salaries of employees, etc. And every month your variable cost is $5,000 which comes from stationery, various bills, etc. So your total cost is $15,000 a month. Every unit you sell, you are making a profit of $50. So right now, if you consider number of units that you've sold is zero, your loss is $15,000. So we need to know exactly how many number of units we want to sell to get a profit of $10,000 every month. How do we do this? So first we keep our cursor on the profit loss cell that is B5. We go to data tab, what if analysis and goal seek. Once we click here, we get three options. One is set cell. It's automatically take it profit loss cell because your cursor was there. To value. To what value? You want this value to be positive $10,000. By changing what cell? For this, you will select a number of units to sell so that automatically it will calculate exactly how many units to be sold to get a profit of $10,000. Let's press OK. It's calculated immediately to 500 units so 500 into $50 gives you a profit of $25,000 minus your cost of $15,000 gives you a final profit of $10,000. It becomes so easy. Now if you want to keep this, you press OK or you press cancel. Let's press OK for now. But in reality, you know that you are not able to sell 500 units every month. The sales are happening as 475 units every month. So right now you are at a profit of $8,750. But you need to reach $10,000 anyhow. So what are the options? Your fixed cost you are not able to reduce. Variable cost, yes, you can somewhere save money there. So that is one option. And the second option is you increase the profit per unit sold. Let us take both the cases one by one. First, we want to be able to understand how much variable cost do I need to reduce for me to get a profit of $10,000. So I keep my cursor again on profit loss, go to data tab, what if analysis, goal seek. Set cell, profit loss, to value $10,000, that's for the profit we need, by changing variable cost and we press OK. So now we simply know that to get $10,000 profit, the variable cost should have been 3750. This is a very simple calculation which you could have done even on your fingers. So let's go back, pressing cancel. But now if I ask you what should be the exact profit per unit to get $10,000, that's a little tricky. So let's see how to do that. Again, what if analysis? Goal seek, set cell to value $10,000 by changing cell profit and press OK. Now we know that if you increase your margin by $3 per unit sold at 475 units being sold, your profit will still be $10,000. This is an excellent feature to do a lot of kind of analysis. Do use it. Thank you for watching.